Okay, uh, I, will little bit do, I will explain about a little bit about hardware first. So this is the Arduino Uno you have now. Actually, the, uh, the essential component is actually just this little uh, microcontroller. That's it. That's all you need. But this microcontroller actually needs a power supply. And actually, this power supply, and also it needs to be connected to a computer. And actually, the left side of this part is actually handling that part. So actually, this one is like something additional. This one is not related with our uh, microcontroller, but simply this one provides USB connection. And actually, this one is actually USB actually gives you 12 volt, but actually microcontroller uses actually 5 volt. So actually, that's one the regulator or power transformer, which is uh, change a voltage from 12 volt to 5 volt and 5 volt goes to this microcontroller and then you probably whenever you um, upload your code what you will see is blinking of this TX and SX did you recognize that uh, TX and RX what does that mean is uh, this microcontroller is actually uh, kind of communicate with a computer and then TX Rx means they kind of extend the signal and receive signal. It's basically just kind of communicating. That's why you see blinking. And then actually these pins, all the black one, is connected to the pins of the upper part of the microcontroller. And another pins on the bottom one is actually connected to the other, the other side of the microcontroller. That's it. So basically this one just has a kind of hardware setting to help you to connect any kind of devices to your microcontroller, that's it. Um, this is kind of pretty much basic so far. And then once the USB cable is uh, used mainly, in, mainly for two functions, one thing is actually power supply, and the other one is actually communication, which is uploading your software to that. But actually, there's another power connection here, which is actually using 9 volts, meaning that once you upload your software, you can disconnect Arduino uh, from your computer. Then if you connect to 9 volt battery here, actually it will run by itself. So actually this one actually run independently from your computer. That's it. Okay, so this is roughly about uh, hardware itself.